Hi there, it's Lisa, and welcome back to my Pagan Pathworks. And so in today's video, I'm going to do a product review, and I'm also going to show you some products I am working on myself that um, if, I, if I can get, if I can perfect my technique and get them um, where they're in, where they look nice, and I will put them on my shop. I do have a shop on on my Facebook page, and it's at the at my 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 pig and path work um, on Facebook. Um, so I hope to have them in the shop pretty soon. Um, if you're interested in buying them, and of course you do not need to buy them for me. If you go out on Etsy, you can find a lot on Etsy as well. Um, that's already made. Um, so this is about two things that you can do um, to help the environment that doesn't cost a lot and can actually save you some money in the long run. So I found a little company called theearthlingco.com. And they are a, a very small company, and they their focus is helping people convert their households from high um, use. It helps you get away from single use items and put you on a more um, sustainable level and one of those things that, that they sell on their website is um, this is what the package looks packaging looks like it's um, just a bamboo toothbrush um, and this is what it comes in there is no plastic on this it's 100% cardboard it's 100% recyclable that's the first thing. Um, it's organic. Um, it's made from natural ingredients and it's biodegradable and it's sustainable development and it's compostable. So when you're done with the toothbrush, you don't have to throw it in the trash. If you have a compost pile, you can put it in the compost um, because it's made out of bamboo. And this, this is mine. Of course, I've been using it. Um, the the bristles are a little are um they they're not too extremely soft at first but they get that way over time. However, even though this is wood, it is bamboo wood, and it doesn't splinter like a lot of other wooden toothbrushes might. Um, it's got a very smooth um texture on it, even though it's grooved. It's very smooth, and they don't um. They don't wear out before it's time to change your toothbrush because um, I think right now you're supposed to change it every six months. Um, so um, I have not had any problems with splintering or or the bristles coming out. Um, it the, it is a very good toothbrush, and I would recommend this to anybody who's want to switch over from the plastic and nylon toothbrushes. This is uh, it's. Like it's an organic product and it's 100% natural, so there's no chemicals to leach out of it like there is with the plastic. Um, so that's the first part. And the EarthlingCo.com is the name of the website if you're interested in getting that. And so the other thing is every morning, um, that I don't have to open or be at work early. Um, I make myself a pot of coffee and. I started out sewing these as uh, a spoon mat, and so instead of using the paper towels, um, I I use these products instead. Now they have, I, I call them a spoon mat. Um, they also go by mug rug um, or a coaster, whatever you want to call them. Um, but that these um, these are one that I've just sewn. Um, so I need a little bit more practice and I want to really perfect these seams because as you can see on this side, um, they're just, they, they just, 
you know, they're just a little bit too imperfect for me. I need it. And this is the other one I wanted to show you. Um, so I plan on, um, on having um, five different colors on here. Uh, this one is especially, you can see the up here at the top, you can see the imperfections. Um, which, if you like imperfections and you don't mind it having that really homemade look, um, I suppose that would be okay. But I, I, I really recommend these and to use in place of your paper towels for like your spoons or, or to put your cups on. It's it really eliminates a lot of paper. Um, these are reusable. You don't have to wash them every time, but they are washable. So and that's 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 one of the best things about this is that there are you can throw them in the laundromat or in the washing machine and wash them and reuse them and they last for a very long time. Um, the ones that the ones I've been using that I made at Christmas time are out of flannel and they shrink a little bit, but they are in still really excellent condition. I expect that they would last uh, for a, a very very long time. So this is like when this is 100% cotton material and there is 100% um, cotton on the inside, and um, unfortunately um. Uh, the thread itself is nylon. Is it's um, polyester thread. Um, I I like to use cotton, but when you're living on a budget, um, sometimes you have to use polyester because um, it's a little cheaper than cotton. Um, but anyway, I do recommend these. Um, they are are a great alternative to the coasters. They they are not 100% waterproof. Um, I did get a hold of some. PLU, which would help waterproof them on the back side. Um, I haven't sewn any with PLU yet. Um, I've, um, I've been too focused on getting the garden started and um, we just had so much errands and stuff to run on days off that on my days off we just kind of cram everything in there. Um, so I will keep you posted and let you know when these are in the shop if you're interested in buying them from my shop. Um, other than that, um, I hope this has been informative and helpful and I invite you to like and subscribe and hit that bell so you can get notified when I upload some new videos. And as always, thank you so much for watching and appreciate your time and attention.